Good evening and welcome to Daily Devotions. I'm Deacon Mindy Bugai and I'm so glad that you're joining me this evening. We want to encourage everyone to continue to go to our website, which is godamong.us, and um, find updates to how we will be gathering together in person and the ability to continue to worship and um, fellowship with us online as well. So do go to godamong.us on a regular basis for those updates. Um, For the devotion this evening, I'm going to do something a little bit different. I um, recently got a copy of a book that um, is written by Rachel Held Evans and Matthew Paul Turner. Now, it is a children's book. But the title is, What is God Like?, And I think even for adults, sometimes we might struggle or um, forget what God is like. And um, Rachel Held Evans is one of my favorite authors. And so for her to write this children's book, I just thought it would be kind of maybe fun and a little different for all of us to just ponder how she has presented um, God in this text. So what is God like? That's a very big question. One that people from places all around the world have wondered about since the beginning of time. And while nobody has seen all of God, because God is far too big for any of us to fully see, we can know what God is like. God is like an eagle, sharp-eyed and swift with wings so wide that you can play under their shadows. God is like a river, constant and and life-giving. When you grow near God, you'll sprout up strong as a tree. God is like the stars, forever present and bright. Even when they feel far away, you can always look up and see them winking at you. God is like a shepherd, brave and good. A protector who loves her sheep so much that she watches over all of them and knows each of them by name, by heart. God is like a fort, strong and secure with walls that are mighty and safe. Inside, there are hidden places to hold you when you're scared or need a quiet place to rest. God is like a gardener, patient and nurturing. God plants, waters, weeds, fertilizes the earth until every good thing on it seeks the nourishing sun and grows. God is like the flame of a candle, warm and inviting. With God close by, you can look to the light and see through the dark, darkest of nights. God is like the wind, passionate and full of mystery. God is both here and mysteriously also over there. God is everywhere, swirling throughout the world, whistling across the mountain ranges, rustling through trees and pressing against your cheeks on a breezy day. God is like an artist, creative and unpredictable, always busy making and remaking everything brilliant and new. God is like a mother, strong and safe. You can crawl up into her lap whenever you want to, and she will hold you until you fall asleep. God is like a father, gentle and safe. He will put you on top of his shoulders and give you a bird's eye view of all creation. God is like three dancers, graceful and precise. They move to the same music in every in very different ways, showcasing all of God's elegance and rhythm in your life. God is like a rainbow, vivid and full of color, 
a dazzling reminder of promise and hope for all people after a storm. God is like a best friend, faithful and true, closer to you than even your brothers and sisters. And because we know what God is like, we know that God is kind, God is forgiving, God is slow to get angry, God is quick to be glad, God is happy when you tell the truth and sad when things are unfair. She is your protector. He is trustworthy. They are friends when you feel alone. God hopes, God perseveres. What is God like? That's a very big question. One that people from all places around the world throughout all time have answered in many different ways. Keep searching, keep wondering, keep learning about God. But what, whenever you aren't sure what God is like, think about what makes you feel safe, what makes you feel brave, what makes you feel loved. That's what God is like. So I thank you for sharing this bit of time with me. I hope you found the book, um, you know, a charming remembrance of what it is that God is like in our lives. And um, I hope you'll share the book. Again, it's entitled, What is God Like? by Rachel Held Evans and Matthew Turner. Good night. God bless.